Hello, I'm Kim Brewster Rossiter, and along with my friends, this is Spotlight Saturday, episode 62! Happy St. Patrick's Day weekend, everybody. I know there's rocking and rolling all over the United States. Everybody's having just a celebration opportunity. I've talked to the ambassadors. They've got races as far as Oregon, Washington, down happening in all parts of Texas, Virginia, New York. I could go on. There's a lot of racing happening this weekend. So we're going to focus this episode on seeing a couple different places. We're going to go to the Carolinas. We're going to have an opportunity to go up to Pennsylvania and even up as far north as Wisconsin. So, but first, let's, uh, remember those guys from the opening just a minute ago? Huh? Brody and Ashton and Michael? Well, had a chance to do a quick interview with them. So let's kick it off with that as they got some special stuff that they're about to do tomorrow. All right, this is super cool. So I'm hanging out with Brody and Michael. And of course, who's that man in the chair? Who is that? That's me. That's right, Ashton McCormick. What are you doing this weekend, Ashton? The Jeremiah's Marathon. Wow, yes, the Shamrock Marathon. Michael, tell us more about the great plan you have for tomorrow. Well, uh, <laughs> the Shamrock Marathon uh, this Sunday is going to be great. It's gonna, uh, I'm going to push Ashton in the full marathon with uh, Brody as my guide runner. Oh, Brody, what's that all about? You're going to be a guide runner? I'm so excited. A little nervous. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Uh, got to be loud, got to be direct, and talk to people on the way, but I am ready to go i love that ashton what are you most excited about for the for the marathon what's your going to be your favorite part i don't know where am i going to be hey. what is that you get your favorite part's going to be when you see the other runners or what i don't know you're not sure are you going to win ashton yeah oh wow you're going to win i love that i think you are going to win well gentlemen we the entire angels angel of america family wishes all three of you an amazing race tomorrow and uh, may the wind be at your back. Thank you. Thank right, you. We'll be, you we'll, we look forward to seeing all the fun pictures. Definitely. All right. Bye, Ashton. Bye, Ashton. Bye. Really excited for you all. Looking forward to hearing all the great stories and seeing the wonderful photos of tomorrow's race. Uh, their team, Pretzel Hands. Good luck, boys. Hey, let's make a trip down to Shelly, Ambassador Shelly in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. She's got a little announcement as she celebrates partnership. We have something so cool and so exciting to announce today that they're letting us uh, take the stage for a minute. We've got Curtis Boyd. Curtis, we're going to call you up here for a minute. Curtis is on the way. Say, come on, Curtis. Curtis Boyd, coming up here. So we are... We're all volunteer. Everything we do is volunteer. So we rely on the generosity of donations and gift supports from the community. We have been working toward fundraising to purchase a storage trailer so we can get our equipment from point A to point B. We drive that orange Jeep and it does not fit a whole lot of stuff. So as we've grown, we have needed a storage trailer. This week, we were introduced to this wonderful earthly angel right here, Curtis Boyd, and he had a storage trailer for sale. We started chatting a little bit about possibilities of purchasing that from him. He got some information for us. I agree. Woohoo! We got some information from us and called back, and he has gifted that gray and silver storage trailer to Ainsley's Angels. Congratulations on the trailer, Shelly and Mike, and more importantly, that amazing partnership that you're forming. We're grateful, grateful for all of our partners, especially those that are so active in their local communities. So really, really excited for you all. Hey, we're going to scoot up the road here to southeastern North Carolina. Ambassador Kelly is with a few angels. Hi, this is Kelly with Southeast North Carolina Ambassadorship, and I'm here with the dynamic duo, Lakikas. We actually have Nick here. He is our equipment manager. Hey, everybody. And this is Susan, and she is our rider coordinator and my right-hand lady, the lead guardian. Hi, guys. So, Nick, can you tell us what you actually do as an equipment manager and what an important job it is? Well, basically, it's an awesome job because I get to take care of all the equipment and make sure it's up, safe, and put together properly so the riders can have a, a really enjoyable experience. 
And it's nothing like seeing them coming across the finish line with that big smile on their face, knowing they had an awesome time out there on the track. It's not too bad of a job. I think it's a great job, and it's one that I'm very proud to be part of. Well, thank you, Nick. And Susan, what does it mean to you to be the rider coordinator for all our athlete riders here in Southeast? It's an absolute joy to be involved with our riders and with their families and get to see them come out here and help them to enjoy the thrill of the race and roll with the wind every time we race here in Southeast North Carolina and to be a part of this movement of inclusion that Ainsley's Angels is part of. Well, that, that's it, folks. We are here at our HCA 5K. This was our first ever race that we ever attended as the Duplin Satellite. So this is our year anniversary race here. And uh, we'd like to just wish you all a happy weekend. Hi, this is Southeast North Carolina, and I'm here with Hunter, our athlete rider, and her sister, Connor. And they're here getting ready to roll with the wind today. Hunter, are you excited? Let me hear it, girl. Hunter. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Hunter, are you excited? Oh, that smile says it all. All right, we can't wait to see you finish that fi cross, ugh, cross that finish line. I'll tell you what, Kelly, just the opportunity for you to introduce us to those amazing guardian angels that you have in your ambassadorship, the role that our, our equipment folks play, I mean, just, just critical. So thanks for sharing that with us. And of course, you got to love the sisters having such a good time rolling and having just a good time together. And I, of course, I, I think Bradley might have got a little blooper there at the end. Very cool. Okay, hey, I understand that Ambassador Amanda has a little update for us up in southeast Pennsylvania. So we're going to make a trip up there. I know it's a little frigid. Uh, let's see what she's got happening. Hey, I'm Amanda here with Southeastern PA, and we are right now at the Shake Your Shamrock 8K, 5K race. We have our Kids Fun Run coming in. Some more kids are coming around the corner right now, but we are squad deep today. We have nearly 20 runners. We have seven riders due to the weather, and we're so ready to race today. So making Anzi's Angels proud, our first race of the season, and we're so looking forward to it. Well, stand by for the finish. See you guys. Squad deep. I love it. Such a good time up there. Again, like I said at the beginning, shamrock opportunities all over the United States. Awesome to see Southeast PA representing. Such a good time all the time. Hey, look, the other thing that's happening, obviously a couple weeks ago, we had our big race down in eastern North Carolina, and some of our ambassadorships actually join us virtually. We love it when they do that. In fact, Ellie, one of our newest ambassadors up there in Wisconsin, has got a little clip she's going to show us of how they celebrated virtually the Angels Angels Race Series. Ellie, what's going on? Hi everyone, it's Briley. I just wanted to point out the fact that we're about to hear from Ellie. And already in the video, we have heard from Shelly and Kelly. Why did Dad not bring attention to that? That's the best thing I've ever heard. Okay, enjoy! Hey everyone, it's Ellie from Wisconsin. Last weekend, we had an amazing opportunity to join the virtual option for the Run With Your Heart 5K. We had an amazing turnout and we all had a blast. Even though it was only 34 degrees out with the wind blowing, it was really cold. We had a great time and can't wait to all get together again to run another race. Thanks for bringing that, Ellie. I love it. Thank you so much. And congratulations on what I understand was really your first race that you've put together up there in Wisconsin. We're really excited about the future, especially as the months get warmer up there in the uh, frozen tundra. So welcome aboard. Good job. Congratulations. And thanks for setting the example about ambassadorships getting out there and experiencing the virtual races. If any of you want to do a virtual race as we conclude this episode, I just want you to know down in the description, we're putting a, a great opportunity for you to do two of our next races with one registration. Registration. It's the west to east uh, 48. So you're basically doing the uh, Together We Shall and the Run for Inclusion in one registration. Only $48 gets you registered and allows you to run a 5K in the west and a 5K in the east. Comes with the bling, everything else. We're only going to keep that offer open for the next week, so link is in the description. All right, y'all, hope you enjoyed this episode. I hope the Shamrock and the amazing St. Patty's Day experience is fabulous for all of you, and we'll see you in 63. Meanwhile, <laughs> a young angel.